Hello guys, welcome back. You are at Basic Marine Engineering. This today I am going to talk about sewage treatment plant, and you can see the big pipe which is coming is all your sewage will come from every bathroom, and this pipe is your vent uh, here. This is your vent, and behind we also have one uh, pipe which might come from your grey water. And let's go to the diagram which is there here. Here the pipe which is coming to first tank, then it will go to your second tank. I'll show you the chlorination chamber. The pipe, uh, two pipes which you can see, and one probe with wire. You can see the chlorination chamber is that part. Those part is in the chlorination chamber. Here the chlorination chamber is in the middle. So water from first stage will go to the second stage, and then here air supply will take place, and it will push all the undecomposed particles back to the first and second chamber, so that decomposition takes place. And here the water after second stage will pass through this. And enter chlorination chamber or sterilization chamber, whatever it is called here. This are here is the pipes where you add chlorine tablets. Inside these two pipes, there are chlorine tablets, and down there are holes. So water will flow through the holes, touching the chlorine tablets, and every liquid will be chlorinized or sterilized. And uh, what uh, basically happens is here is uh, your uh, bacteria is decomposing the uh, whatever waste which we are producing. So, these are aerobic bacteria. So we supply more air so that more bacteria will be produced and decomposition will be faster. So that is the reason we are adding, we are giving air supply. Now I'll show you your. This is your blower, which is supplying air supply, or compressor you can call. And here is your chlorine tablet, which I had shown you. Know the two pipes, the black color cover you can see. Let me mark it up. These two pipes. The top cover you'll open and add the chlorine tablets. And um, let me show you the air uh, compressor from the compressor how it is going. And this line is a overflow line. And from this is your compressor. The pipe is going. That valve is a non-return valve, and it will go enter two places. The two places in the diagram which I had shown you. And this is a suction line from each stage. And this in between is a isolating valve. And this is your discharge pump. A discharge pump will send to here. Also, we are uh, having a sea water connection to flush. One line goes to tank. One line is going to show connection, and one line will go to overboard. So, I hope you have uh, understood this part. So, theory is very simple. First, uh, you have mostly all sewage treatment plant. You will have three stages. First stage, it enters. It will uh, have a mesh like where it will be broken down into smaller particles, or you will have a uh, blades or uh, impeller like which will turn when the waste falls on it. Then you have uh, it goes through aerobic stage or aeration will take place here only, and settling stage will have the settling after the settling stage again it will pass back to the first aeration stage. The air will keep circulating, and sometimes you will see a transparent pipes which are there on top. Uh, in which the circulation taking place. So from there, after the settling stage, it will flow back to chlorination chamber or sterilization chamber. Uh, in the uh, st while flowing to the chlorination chamber, you will have uh, pipes which I showed you all, flowing through the pipes through the pipes so that uh, through the holes it will touch to the chlorine tablets and all will get chlorinated. And uh, sterilization will take place. Sometimes you'll also see UV lights. Nowadays you'll find uh, a small chamber with UV light so that uh, you kill all the microorganisms. Basically, what you are doing, why you're doing chlorination, is uh, to kill the bacteria which we have created ourselves. So, so that it, it doesn't affect the outside environment. And uh, chlorination should not be also very much. It should be below 10 ppm uh, so that it doesn't affect the microorganisms which are there in the water. Hope you have liked the video. If you have liked the video, please like, comment, share, and let me know your thoughts. Any doubts you all have, uh, please comment. Uh, thank you.